Hi, this is Ross with My Service Depot, and today we're going to go over how to create your own custom reports using Smart Service. Now we start by coming to the Reporting tab. Once we're there, we click New Report up to the top left. Now we're going to come up to the report name and we're going to type in what type of report we're going to actually create. We're going to go ahead and create a additional scheduled dates for our jobs. Come to our type. We're going to select scheduled additional dates. And then also type in a brief description. Now once we're in here, we come down to report fields. Now this is where we select what information we wish to appear onto the report. So you select the information you wish to show. We want to get the scheduled date in there. And employee. Get the scheduled start time and end time. Now if you need additional fields, you can also come up here to portrait and switch to the landscape which gives you two additional fields. Now once you have all your fields selected, you can also come down here to alias. And alias gives you the ability to select or type in whatever you want into this. So I just want to say customer rather than customer name. And also come here to select fixed and count. So this will actually count the number of customers and jobs we have in this report. The next we can come to report sort. Now this is where you can sort your report. And we want to sort by our scheduled date and also by our scheduled employee. We even have the report group. So come over here, and I want to group it by scheduled employee. Now once you're done, and all your information in, all you have to do is click save and close up to the top right. And now to our left, you can see schedule additional dates. And now there's our report we just created. So now if we click the first option, print preview, that will bring you into the report. So now you can see all the different jobs we have in here. So right now we have 22 pages. We want to filter this down, see just a certain customer. So we're going to exit out of this and come to our fourth icon, the filter. We're going to select our first box, select customer name equals, we can then select one value, select our customer. Once you're done, we click preview report. Now it brings us into the report and shows us all the scheduled jobs for Ed Moore and all the additional dates. Now it's great about once you're in this report, we can even come up to the top left and click print preview to print this off or even export this information to Word or Excel. And a great new option, of course, email. I can click email and convert this into a PDF and it opens up my email with this already attached to it. You also have the option here to change the filter. So if I just want to see a, a date range of these jobs, come in here, select our field. Now equals just allows you to select one value, but I want to see a date range. So I can come in here and say between. Gives you the ability to have a custom date range. So now I come in here, select our value, and click Save and Close. Now it's going to filter that list down and just show us all the edge jobs in that date range. So it's that quick and easy to customize and filter out your reports using Smart Service. Now for more info, go to smartservice.com or follow us on Facebook and Twitter with the links below.